Hello, and welcome to this month's episode of Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce's Home Shopping Experience. I'm your host, Des, and we have some amazing guests prepared for you today. FNBCC is in its 20th year engaging, educating, and empowering businesses all over the Central Valley. We've got a great selection of those businesses here with us today, so sit back and relax and get ready to shop. Ready to unlock all the available resources to you as a Black entrepreneur? Want to connect with one of the largest business organizations in the Central Valley? As a member of the Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce, you get the power of these resources and more. Become a member. Visit fmbcc.com slash membership and get started today. And we are back with one of my absolute favorite cafes, Tower Blends in Tower. It's in my hood. We're here with the owner, Anthony, uh, Ori, and Anthony. So excited to have you guys here. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, yeah welcome. Yeah, I appreciate the welcome. Um, the boys are actually going to be taking over today. Awesome. Um, so we'll be walking you through our smoothie process. I'm going to be your smoothie assistant today, guys. <laughs> awesome. Tell us a little bit before you get out of here, Anthony. Sure. Tell us a little bit about the shop, yeah. when you opened up, like what your inspiration was behind the concept. Absolutely. Um, oh? Okay, so um, once my dad, he had to go get his blood work done, but it actually turned out pretty bad, and he had the risk of having diabetes. So oh, wow. we started making um, smoothies that we called power juice. And so we would mix up different fruits and vegetables to try and see like which one tasted better and we would drink it every day. Um, yeah. And so we were doing this program called Green Circle at Cindy's Frozen Yogurt. Mm -hmm. And so, um, yeah, and so we had the chance to actually buy by the property and so we did and so we were like hmm what are we gonna do with this new thing that we just acquired and so we thought oh yeah we can use the power juice and turn it into a business oh so my God. it started with the smoothies and then we made acai bowls and we just kept adding on over time mm -hmm. the tower bowl is the most popular for 2019 tower bowl is the most popular for 2020 and then the Tower Bowl is now the most popular for, for 2021. You said the Tower Bowl? Yeah. Tower Bowl. It's yeah. an acai bowl. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Um, yeah, so. That's how we started. Yeah, that's how we started. So, so exciting. Yeah. You, oh my gosh, you guys have Poke Bowls yeah, too? Now that I have not food. tried it, yeah. I am excited to try the Poke Bowls. Yes. I gotta tell you, I'm I'm almost getting emotional hearing your child oh, explain the process of the building of your business. I, I mean, we're here with with the Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce, and Anthony has been a longtime member of ours. Um, and this is, to me, literally the goal of the chamber is building general, generational wealth Absolutely. in the black community. And so, seeing you pass this legacy oh. on to your young kings is everything for me. And That's what it's all and about. them understanding the benefits of health and, right. and being conscious of these things, like you are doing an excellent job. They live in proof. They live in proof of our legacy, and I think that for me is the most important part of what we're. Thank Not you so place. much. I'm so happy you brought your boys with you today. Oh my gosh. I'm also excited to make a smoothie. I love the smoothies. I always get, uh, I think, the power smoothie. Okay. When I go, I also, tell me the spicy juice shot that I take all the time, and I'm like, ah. So <laughs> it's that is called... our ginger shot, yeah? Yeah. So it's it's a ginger shot. There's three types, and I think you just took the spicy one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so it was very spicy. Yeah. <laughs> right before we came on camera, I was like, ooh, I need this. I take it for immunity, like, and, like yes. kind of an energy boost. Is that what it's? That's exactly what it's for. Um, the shots are made with cold-pressed juice, and so we got ginger in there. We put turmeric, we put a little cayenne pepper, and we put orange juice. It's all mm -hmm. cold-pressed, so it's all made fresh. And what that does is helps your body to fight off any infections that might be going in through your body. Doesn't it kind of flush you out, too? it flushes too? out. You mm -hmm. can feel it as it travels through your body. You get that warm sensation. Yeah. That ginger shot is a powerful medicine, and it's all natural. And that's what we try to promote with our brand. I go in to the shop whenever I, you know, I've had a long night the night before, <laughs> and I need, need a little energy <laughs> boost. The up. spice is like an instant wake up, exactly. and then I, it's like I can feel it pulsing through me mm -hmm. and, like, getting me back going again after that's 
food is our best medicine, and we strongly believe that. Our brand is built on providing whole foods for our customers and providing whole foods for our community. And so that's why Love the Mantel Blends exist. Guys, tell me the address. Where can people come and check you out, get some of these amazing smoothies? What are your hours? So oh. it's 802 East Olive. What's our hours? Um, seven to 8 to 7, Monday yeah. through Friday, and then 10 to 7 on Saturday. Saturday and Sunday. Yes. You guys open on Sundays too? Yes, we're open every day as of right now, except for I tomorrow, which is uh, Easter, Easter, so we're yep. going to take a rest. I appreciate small businesses that take family time oh, and absolutely. holidays. As a business owner myself, I've always thought it's important for us to take some of the holidays off too. Yes, you can make money, yeah. but it's just nice to spend some time with family sometimes. And so I think it goes a long way a towards break. building that um, um, reciprocity with our team. Because at the end Absolutely. of the day, they are the ones that make it possible for us. I to think that is great. Normalize taking holidays <laughs> and breaks. <laughs> All right. I'm excited to get started with this. So yeah. we are making a smoothie today, right, guys? Yeah. Yes, we are. Uh, this is the power protein. So I'm going to have you walk me through what each thing is. You said we start with the liquids, right? Yes. yes. Is there a reason we start with liquids? Um. Yeah. Yes, because you just need a base. So when you pour this in, it doesn't get all gooey. Okay, it makes yeah. sense. Well, so this is uh, plant-based milk. Almond milk. Almond. Yeah. This is almond milk. Yes. So um, yeah, you're gonna go ahead and pour all of it in there. All right. What is the benefit of almond milk? Almond milk. Well, it provides vitamins A and E, and you can also use a substitute for soy milk. Um, that is helps. No, you can't. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. And then uh, this looks kind of gross. What is, <laughs> what is this one? Gross. It's called chia seeds, actually. And yeah. we're soaking them in almond milk. That, that that's actually, what I was going to say because yeah. I've seen it like in, you know, just the seeds themselves. Yeah. I've never right. seen it like this. This looks like alien eyeballs. <laughs> 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 so, so what does soaking it do? What it does is actually uh, it makes the chia seeds expand and mm -hmm. it actually helps make it more absorbable or bioavailable to you. Because I always wonder when you eat it in its seed form, like, right. is it really, you know? It's not as actually uh, ingestible by your body when it's in a seed form. So when you soak it, you actually get it to expand Very and all good. the nutrients that are in that chia is it, uh, released. You're teaching us something today. Oh, yeah, yes. it's all about that. All right, let's get all of that in there. Yeah, so basically the benefit of that is um, it's high nutrients and it's just low in calories. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's very healthy. Yeah. Food. Okay, next? what's next? Um, we, we have, have got, what's uh, oh, coca cacao. Oh, that's protein. Protein, protein powder. So protein powder, mm -hmm. what is it? Is it peanut butter? Promotes mm -hmm. muscle growth. growth yeah. 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 And it's peanut butter flavored? That one is a just kind of like a neutral flavor on that one. Oh, okay. Um, so it doesn't kind of change the taste of the smoothie too much. It, it is a plant-based protein yeah. though. So. Is this flavored? Um, I think that one is a vanilla, probably like a vanilla. Okay. Flavor. And you said what this is, is cacao? Cacao, yeah. it reduces diabetes risk, and then peanut butter is like a good source of protein, and it's very delicious. <laughs> diabetes is a real problem in our community. Yes. Absolutely. That is something that's pretty widespread. And that's why, you know, we're here, because it was something that I was concerned about, you know, through my <laughs> diet. I didn't realize I was unhealthy until... Right, and until it comes back, and, and it's good that you addressed it. Like, it's, I think in the past, people are more likely to just ignore their health issues, ignore oh, the high cholesterol. And, and or go to the doctor, and now they go into this cycle of pills and right. medication to help sustain their health when their food, like I said, is Right, medicine. this is your best medicine. Yes. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, peanut that's peanut butter. butter. Okay, I, I was hoping for some peanut butter. You guys just, I was getting really excited about peanut butter. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Get that in there. Peanut butter, I know, has a lot of protein, right? Yeah. Yeah. Is this a specific kind? It's really creamy. It Ooh. actually lowers the risk of cancer. Really? Yeah. Yeah. But they self-grinded it, so it doesn't taste like skippy or anything. So oh. we actually make our own peanut butter in-house. Ooh, uh, do you buy sell that in jar? We no. do and we don't. Yeah. Um, when oh. customers ask, we can make it available. Awesome. Yeah. I am a customer. I am going to ask. <laughs> so <laughs> just <laughs> heads up on that. Yeah. All right, what do we got here, guys? Okay, so the they're high in nutrients and low in calories. My kids love blueberries. Are you guys big fans? Uh, not very. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Thank you for your honesty. Yeah. <laughs> but they are high in nutrients, yes. right? They're very good for you. All right, what do we got here? So oh, those bananas. are our bananas. They um, improve digestive health and age weight loss. Ooh, 
Now that I need, you guys should have made me two cups of this. <laughs> yes. AIDS weight loss. <laughs> All right, and last up, what do we got here? We got strawberries. Fave, love strawberries. So do I. Tell me about strawberries. How are strawberries good for you? Um, so they're packed with vitamins and fiber and antioxidants. Mm, very good. Very good. All right, I'm ready to blend this up and have some. Yeah. Are you guys going to be my blender assistants? Yes, <laughs> we are. Just cap on. Anthony, right. tell us one more time. Give us the address. And if yes. you have want to share your social media or anything like that. Absolutely. Uh, we are at 802 East Olive Avenue. Uh, we are right across the street from the Tower Theater. Um, our social media is at Tower Blend. Okay, so Make sure you guys follow them. Okay, we're getting this all blended up. Right. This is my dance. Is this your blender dance? <laughs> all right, let me help. Is it, does it help the smoothie come out better? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's got like a process. Yeah. Starts like low-key, takes it up. Like me at the club. <laughs> My kids have don't quite have my palate yet either. You guys yeah. will like this stuff when you get a little bit older. There we You'll go. see. Awesome. I'm gonna have you four. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna That's get a little bit and then I'll share. Oh, I'll be nice and share too. Even though I do love you guys as smoothies. All right, I think we have just enough. Perfect. Perfect. Right. Are you guys gonna sample this with me? Yes, we are. Okay, do you guys take any of the juice shots? How do you guys feel about the, the juice? Shot? Any of them? Because don't you have other shots as well? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, we do. We have the uh, flu shot and we have the spicy ginger shot. Um, actually, he's made a recipe using our ginger shots. Yeah, I know. And so, they're big fans. They really? Oh, right ooh, this is this. good. It's creamy. It's got mm -hmm. a nice texture to it. What's this one? That is your power protein. Oh, this is the, uh, the power but protein. we added the cacao to it to give it a little bit of a chocolate flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That good. is really, really good. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Okay, so tell me about the juices, guys. Tell me about some of the other products you had. You said you just added a poke bowl. Yes. Mm -hmm. You had salads. Right. Um, the grab and goes. We also have uh, like uh, vendors that come in, like Jalen's Bakery, who's another, um, I think, member. Yes, we um, had vegan cookies last month right. on the show. So we oh, have them in so store. Good. We have uh, vegan banana bread, pumpkin bread. Uh, so we have all kinds of products that um, you guys can just come in and try. Uh, we also partner with local business owners. Um, so we have a merchandise wall. So people like Certainly Soap, uh, people like uh, I love certainly so their bakery I, like all of these guys were are in our community that we chosen to partner with to kind of give them a space as well so they love I love that I love that space. local business synergy and that's, that's great. great yeah um, if you guys have time we do have one more smoothie recipes that the boys really love um, mm -hmm. I'm more than happy if you guys want to blend that yeah well. let's 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 get that one going Excellent. yeah so this is your favorite Lori tell us about this one. Oh, okay, so this is called, all right, this is called Tropical Dreams. Ooh, this is beautiful. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I want that's pataya. What is this? This is, that's pataya. Pataya. Also known as dragon fruit. Dragon fruit. Yes, I was like, this looks familiar, but I yeah. don't know what it is. This is a beautiful color. Yeah. And the smoothie is going to come out in that beautiful rose Oh, yeah. I love it. Okay. One more blender right down here by your legs. Oh, awesome. Grab yeah, let's get that out. And then we have your liquids as well for this one. All right. Boys, you want to tell us a little bit about the tropical drink smoothie and what's in it? Oh, yes. Okay. So this is, that's, there's orange water. juice here. Mm -hmm. That's coconut water. This is pataya, like I said, dragon fruit. Um, this is pineapple and, again, strawberries, basically. So give me the quick rundown. What are the health benefits of this smoothie? Okay, so orange juice is high in antioxidants. Um, pataya sorbet is rich in fiber, and it helps lower blood sugar. Pineapple enzymes can ease digestion. Ooh. Digest. I didn't know that. And, then and coconut water. Oh, wait, no. It reduces blood pressure and replaces electro... Like Electrolytes for athletes, basically. Oh, yeah. So Do you guys work with a lot of athletes? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, yeah, that's right and there dad. in tower next to you. And dad. 
Do I put all this fruit in, guys? All of that, too. All right, there we go. This one I know I'm going to like. I love, yeah, go ahead, you throw that one in. I love, the tropical flavors are gonna be amazing. I wish you guys could see what I see. All these beautiful fruit colors. Yep, and we'll put the lid on that one. I just really like the color on the tropical dreams. This is probably one of our kids' favorite. Um, and when parents come in, they can't decide what they want to put their kids. You, you know, just suggest that one, yeah. So here I'm loving this one. Let me get this one. Let's yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot. Gotta, gotta get it going. Yes, there you go. Gotta get it going. I like when it picks up. That's my favorite part. <laughs> <laughs> Do you? Gotta speed it up? All right. My kids are gonna be like, Mom, why are you doing that on TV? <laughs> Des will have you pour this one out. Oh, that is a really, really pretty like pink oh, color. You know, I feel like things that are beautiful taste better. Is that just me? And part of the reason why we like having our cups with the clear so everybody can so see So you can that see all that lovely, yummy. Mm. This is gorgeous. You guys make sure to stop by Tower Blends in the Tower District. They're open seven days a week right now. That is amazing. Family friendly and yeah. local. How long have you been in the valley, Anthony? Um, I've been in, in the valley since 1993. I uh, came from Nigeria. Wow. Yeah, so. What brought you to Fresno? Um, not really by choice. <laughs> <laughs> it happens that way sometimes, yeah, but we're happy you're here. Thank you, thank you. But yeah, we just we kind of find it really soon. Oh, this is good. Isn't it? This is really good. What are you tasting? I'm just I'm tasting shorts. the tropical like yeah, flavors. I love the dragon fruit with the <laughs> pineapple. Like it's Hawaii. There you go. You know what? It's definitely yeah. If you need Hawaii vibes without the trip, right. <laughs> stop yeah. by and get this tropical smoothie. And it costs mm. less. <laughs> it costs a lot less too. Thank you guys so much for being here yeah, with us really today, works. Anthony, Ori, Anthony from Tower Blends. Website. Make sure you guys stop by and visit. Tell us your website one more time and it's, your address. It's towerblends.com, and we are 802 East Olive Avenue, uh, right across from the Tower Theater. Thanks, guys. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Ready to unlock all the available resources to you as a Black entrepreneur? Want to connect with one of the largest business organizations in the Central Valley? As a member of the Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce, you get the power of these resources and more. Become a member. Visit fmbcc.com slash membership and get started today. Chassis Post is Yahoo's lifestyle contributing editor. She's brought us some of her favorite products for the searing summer days. Chassie, great hot. to see you. Great to see you guys. And yes, we're going to cool down, starting with Willie. I mean, look. look. This. this is a solar power fan hat. I love this hat. hat. I have a giant head, but. I mean, just do you have that a large out. or an extra oh, large? Oh, yes. All sizes. This is oh so God. cool. It's from Cool Breeze Solar fan hat. And we are back with Dr. Bernice Nellen from Cool Breeze Solar Hat. Hi. Hi. I'm How glad to you? be here. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. I'm so happy to have you here. This is actually my first time seeing these in person, but I've seen them all over the internet. You are a big deal here in Fresno. Okay. You say so. <laughs> I I'll do, take it. If I do say so, I, I do say so it. myself. <laughs> yes. Uh, tell me a little bit about how you guys got started. How long have you been making these hats? We've been making them for quite some time. We went official in 2013 um, because people just kind of wanted them and loved them. And so after we did our R&D, we brought them to market. So yeah, and here we are. Where did you get the idea to make this hat? Or what was the inspiration for it? My husband. Husband being an engineer, um, being on the roof, a solar contractor, being hot, couldn't keep his head cool. And so here we are. And we started, um, he started dickering in the garage, trying to figure out how does he keep his head cool, and this was the birth of Cool Breeze Solar Hats. These are amazing. I love hats, first of all, but you, it's, so it's extremely fashionable, but it's also the fan, like, it's crazy. Let me, I'm just gonna, if you don't mind. Very <laughs> sexy, let me just thank fix you. it for you. Let yes, for thank you. you. Okay, so. All right. So I'm outside, I'm in the sun, it's hot. I'm at a festival, I'm always at festivals, <laughs> and, this thing just kicks on? Yep. So let me tell you how it starts or how it works, right? Show really me. simple. So the sun hits the panel, 
The panel then operates the fan, and I'm going to turn this light on because this is the imitation light, okay? So it'll turn the fa fan on, and then it blows the air straight out the back of a hole. Very simple. And the more direct sunlight that you have is the faster that the fan will go. So Once if it's a really hot day, that thing's oh, going to be going. Free air conditioning. No, you don't have to pay for nothing. No more Love hot heads. It. That's what we always say. No more hot heads, right? And then the minute you step out of the sun, it automatically stops. And they come in different styles and variations. You have on our fedora right now. It comes in natural and brown. We have men variations. We have women. We have the Thurman. And this is the gentleman ver version of our hat. What was the first hat that you designed? The first hat that we designed was a cowboy and the Thurman. People love the, that style, cowboy and Thurman. Oh, I'd of course, imagine. I didn't get a chance to bring one today, but you could always go to our website at www.coolbreeze solar hats with cool with a K. It's about to start warming up, so I know you guys are about to be selling these like crazy. So, all right, can we turn this on really quick? I just yeah. want to feel that fan coming absolutely. in. So it, absolutely. The fan cools in into the hat. Into the hat, I don't know right? why I kept thinking it's like out that way, but. So you're not going to feel a whole lot of air in here because this oh, is the imitation, I do feel it, but though. you feel yeah, it, right? I yes. do. I feel it when you put your hand by the fan. Yeah. That yep. would be really nice on a hot day. It's so amazing, though. Let me just make this clear. The air goes in and not out. Yes. A lot of folks will come up and they'll kind of put their hand yeah. in front of the no, fan. No, I did the right? same thing. So right. people always do that. No, I'm not trying to cool you. Yeah. I'm trying to cool myself. Cooling right? myself off. So right. that's, that's the whole idea behind the hat. That is amazing. So I'm excited to have you here on our local home shopping experience because you've actually been on the home shopping network. Yes, yes. That's amazing. Last year we developed that, uh, cultivated the relationship with the home shopping network, so we're really excited. So you can find us there as well. Wow, that is huge. And homegrown right here in the, well, how long have you been in the valley? Well, I am a transplant. Yes. So I've I, been in the valley. I can hear your about, accent. I was like, this is not a homegrown <laughs> Fresnan right here. I know. I say I forgive my husband because my husband's been raised and born here. But I'm from New York City. Okay. Right? So I've been here probably about 15 years now. Nice. 15 years now. So I guess, yes, I'm a little bit of Fresian. A little bit. A yeah, little bit. A little bit. Yeah. People come here and it's like a vortex. You just like, can't get out of it. <laughs> I love Fresno personally, born and raised here. I'm so excited to have you guys as members of our Black Chamber. I think it's so important for us to you know, have these connections in the community and like with people, businesses like you that are doing it on such a huge level and showing people out there that it really is possible to have like an operation of this magnitude out of this city. Thank you, thank you. Actually, um, talking about magnitude, we're also in Walmart. So wow. you can find us in Walmart. We do have a gardener hat that is in Walmart. So we're really excited about our products. We're always coming out with new ideas. And I'll just give you a sneak peek behind the veil and it's being announced right here today for the first time. We're coming out with a suede and a felt hat. So oh ladies and gentlemen, look out. We have a new product hitting the line. I but I won't so tell you excited. when, so just keep going to the website and Check it out the website. will get there soon enough. Awesome. Is this a newer product that you guys have been making or is this something you've been doing a yes, while? Yes, yes. So a lot of individuals from the construction industry buy our Thurman hats, but they were like, when are you going to come out with a hard hat version? So for years we've been working on a hard hat version because of the simple factor that the hat had to be tested. Mm -hmm. It is ANSI and compliant. Um, so ANSI and OSHA compliant. Let me not leave out OSHA. And so Cannot right now, OSHA. I know, right? Can't <laughs> leave out OSHA, right? So this is the front of the hat. This is the back of the hat where we have a dual fan. And the way that this hat operates, it doesn't operate just by stepping out into the sun. It has an on off button uh, inside, right? And I will turn it on and see if you guys can kind of hear it a little bit. When you are working, Ooh. you will not hear that sound, okay? But the fan turns on and you're allowed to uh, do either high or low, just depending on the, the heat that you're experiencing. And then when you don't need it, um, it is being, um, it's a battery inside. There's a battery inside. So the Does sun, the battery recharge with the solar? Yes, yes, exactly. Awesome. That's what I was going to say. So the sun is hitting the panels, the panels are then charging the battery, and that allows an individual to then be able to work indoors or outdoors. So we were thinking about the construction worker that's working indoors as well. Mm -hmm. They get hot and they want to stay cool as well. So the whole model across our board 
is no more hotheads, right? We want you guys to be cool. We want you to enjoy as well as be safe while you're working outdoors. I love that. And so for this product, though, you can find it at www. Uh, CoolBreezeSolarHardHats.com, and again, it's cool with a K. Okay. Cool with a K. Yes. These products are amazing. So this is really popular with gardeners. I yes. Imagine. Is this with a gardeners, with hikers, fishermen, um, ladies who are gardening, you know, all everyone. As long as you have a head and you want to remain cool. There we go. Okay. <laughs> That's a, if you have a head. You have a head and you want to remain cool. And you cool, want to keep that head cool. You want to remain safe. It is 50 plus UVP. So it's been <laughs> tested and uh, yeah, let's, let's, you know, stay cool. Let's and stay safe. They're, they're functional, but they really are so fashionable. Like I really would wear this hat. I love, is this an addition that you would add on yourself? We correct, have the, correct. Okay, so the, you don't sell these. We do. Is, oh, you do. Yeah, you sell do. these add-ons as add-ons to the hat. We sell the add-ons as well. Because I really love the scarf addition to it, and you said that's a way that you can kind of adjust the size. Correct. Correct. Of the hat. So the the fedora comes in one size. The scarves we always send a starter scarf. So you always start with something, and then when you get home, the way that I made it was because because I might send a purple, and you're wearing a green dress. You're not going to wear green and purple, so you want to change the scarf. Right. But the women's hats always come with a starter scarf. The fedora is one size, the floppy is one size, and the majority of the rest of them come in different sizes: mm. small, medium, large, and extra large. So the one you have on is a one size. And is this band adjustable here? Is this on? Is this the men's fedora? This is the men's fedora. The men's fedora usually the strap comes, um, it's attached. It's usually attached, mm -hmm. unless you request that it's not to be attached and then you can take it off. So you guys but do custom orders as well? We, we do on occasion. Usually on our website, what you see is what you're gonna get. Mm -hmm. But usually if someone comes into our plant and I'm in a good mood, <laughs> Not at all. I'm always in a good mood. She's my name is very nice, so my <laughs> name is always in a good mood. Very nice but, without the Y. Right? <laughs> so usually, though, um, it comes as is, right? So if you see it with a wide band or a thin band, it will come with that. Or they can come plain where you can add your own, you know, own accessory. And you, I'm sure you get a lot of bulk orders, people ordering for their teams at work, for their, for their you know, construction I do. groups and all I of that. I do. We have a wide variety of distributors. Um, of course, the bigger ones that you guys might know is Walmart, HSN, uh, True Value, Ace Hardware, to name a few. Wow. And then we have some other mom and pop distributors across the U.S. And we sell all over the world. So, yeah, we do have distributors and we have individuals that sell on our website and um, our biggest thing is that we just want people to be protected and we want them to be safe and so we're excited to be able to bring this to the market. Uh, tell us your website one more time. Okay. How can we order these Absolutely. amazing hats? Absolutely. Absolutely. So we have two websites. The first one where you can get our casual is www.coolbreezesolarhats and again, the cool is with a K. And where you can find the hard hats is www.coolbreezesolarhardhats. And that's K with, for the cool. Very good. Thank you so much for coming and visiting us today with these amazing hats. Um, I'm you. just so proud of the business that you've built right here, homegrown in the valley. This Thank is, you. These hats are in Walmart, they're on the Home Shopping Network, and they're here on the Home Shopping Experience. Thank you so much for being with us, Dr. Nellen. Thank you for having me. Thank you for having me. Solar Cooling Hard Hats. What is happening? Well, it's solar cooling. What? Hard hats. Okay, so actually this time, what is it? It's technology that replaces old hard hats for workers in construction, building railroads, bricklayers, shoreline dock workers, pipe layers. You get the idea. Not just any hard hat, but the Cool Breeze Solar Hard Hat. Sleek, solar operated with battery backup ready for any day. How'd you get started? Uh, we started business in 2009, uh, Blake Engraving. We, I started uh, at Fresno City College where I did an associate degree in computer drafting and design. And uh, one of the projects we had was to actually use the engraving machine. Yeah, and you and liked it so much. I liked it. I you did, stuck yeah. with it. That's awesome. So 
Uh, you told me that you joined the chamber right when you started your business. Yes, in 2009. Was that something that you felt was important to network and get to know people? And oh, definitely, yes. Get to know more businesses in the area and see how we can actually merge together and do stuff. Do you there. feel like it was helpful for you getting it has started? Been very helpful, yes. I love it has that. Been I love to hear it. All right, awesome. I don't even know where to begin. You have so many amazing engraved things. Um, and with Mother's Day coming up, Father's Day coming up, some great gift ideas. Uh, I'm going to start here. Actually, no, we're not going to start with the dads because it's not their turn yet. It's mom's turn. Uh, and moms love wine. So <laughs> I'm loving this engraved glass. It's got the monogrammed M on it. Uh, do you do a lot of gifts for people? Uh, we do a lot of. Uh Wine, wine stem for uh, events, yeah. uh, special occasions. Weddings, of course. Weddings, yes. Anniversaries, uh, tournaments, definitely. I love that, and this can't come off, right? Yeah, because it's engraved, right? It's <laughs> permanent. Tell me a little bit about the process of this. Do you do this by hand? Uh, no, we have a machine. You have a machine? So most of the engraving is done uh, through a laser machine that I own. Um, the designs are brought to us, or I create or designs. Or you create them for people. And then uh, we running through the computer, goes onto the printer. Do you ever um, get any designs sent to you that are like really fun that you are excited to do? Oh, definitely, yes. We have a, lot of, a lot of exciting stuff, yes. That's nice. I love that. And I see you've got the wedding glass here. Yes. This is great. It's got the little rings, it's got the names, and the date at the bottom. I, I'd imagine this is a big, big seller for you, yes, the wedding well, glasses. Definitely, yes. We do a lot of uh, stuff also for the groomsmen. Mm -hmm. uh, like cocktail glasses. Okay, I guess we can get to this this big giant dad beer mug. I love that. I want to. Uh, is it too early? <laughs> to never start? too early to order. Never too. No, is it too early for a beer? But yeah, never <laughs> too early to order <laughs> that too. Awesome. Okay, so tell me about this keychain. You cut out things as well. It's not just engraving, but yes, also. Yes, we can also uh, cut out uh, designs and put it on keychains. Uh, Wine bottles, we do them on cigar. Ooh, you put them on wine bottles. Wine bottles, yes. Uh, cigar cases. Nice. Definitely. Do people, so they just order them like with their initials, or yes. is that another like gift idea? That would be really cute, I think. You know, a lot of people are doing those bridesmaids kits now when they ask people to be their bridesmaids. And uh, I think these, these types of gifts would be a great addition. Tell me where people can find you online to purchase or if they're interested in uh, contacting you. Yes. Well, we're on Blake Engraving at Vistaprint.com. You can also just look for Blake Engraving uh, Fresno on uh, Google search and mm -hmm. we're there. You can contact us uh, through our telephone number, which is 559-554-0916. Uh, you uh, can always send us a request uh, through Vistaprint. Uh, we always get back to you. We try to get nice. whatever you want to get done. Blake Engraving, for all your gift needs for Mother's Day, Father's Day. We got a lot of people doing weddings right now because yes. they had to hold off. This pandemic year has been crazy. I, I've been doing a lot of weddings as well with, with right. one of my businesses. Has that been picking up for you? It's picking up, yes. It's yeah, up. that's awesome. I love to see local business getting business after such a tough year. So this is an engraved flower vase. That would be a good good Thank Mother's Day. Yes, for mom. So you can personalize anything na with anything, names yes. and. We do not do jewelry. No you, jewelry. No jewelry. Yeah. All right. Why not jewelry? Um, I can't replace that sentimental value if something wants to go bad. That yeah. is an excellent point. Yeah, you would not want to be responsible <laughs> <No>. for <laughs> messing up someone's jewelry. <laughs> okay. So what thing. are these? These are the bookmarks. We do bookmarks with our. Oh, with quotes. Oh, I love, my Angelou is one of my favorites. And this is a, a bookmark here. Very cute. So you've got like, you know, an, a good array of stuff from like a, on the lower price end up to yes. the, yeah. We do a lot of uh, awards also. We've done awards yes. for, uh, for the chamber. Yes, Cleon for... actually made our, uh, the plaque for our Martin Luther King Awards that we did. And um, yeah, they were beautiful. I have one on my shelf. Okay. I received one this year. So that's, uh, you know, exciting. Um, earrings, okay, so tell me about the woodworking. Uh, woodwork, I like woodwork. You really like yes, woodwork? Yes. yes. Is this like your favorite part? It is, yes. These earrings we are- We to create 
a lot of different designs. Is this made of wood too? Uh, that's a uh, mat board. Uh, what's mat board? Tell me more about that. It's more of like what they use behind like picture paper? frames. Yes. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Similar to what the but that's so cute. I don't know if you guys can see, but the earrings are attached to his own little like personalized board. So cute. What do you like about wood versus glass? Tell me. Uh, easy to correct. Easy to correct. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm noticing a theme here. We do not like mistakes, people. No, we do not, right. Oh, Mrs. these are really cute. I love that. And is this the, the dog collar here? Those are dog tags for probably for a Christmas tree, for the ornament. Oh, doing. for like an ornament. I need yes. one of these that says butter. I, my dog's name is Butter. butter. He's butter. crazy. Butter. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you can make me like a stick of butter and just like put butter on it for our ornament. I think that'd be really yeah. cute. And then okay. we have the, uh, the cell phone holder. Oh, is that what this is? Yes. Oh, amazing. And we can actually put the... Uh... Oh, that's so cute. It says, Mom, you're the best. And she can just set her phone up right here. That's awesome. And yeah. she can FaceTime with her kiddos. Yeah, do so you have you a phone for phone? us to... Oh, perfect. And the, it's a design where the cord can go through the bottom. Oh, the back. that's so you can actually awesome. Charge on your when you're actually... This would actually be perfect for me. Like, you know what I mean? Moms these days are... A lot of people are working from home. Yeah, so they can doing use a lot. These for <laughs> this their... is awesome for Zoom. Definitely. This would be great because I'm the type of person that, you know, lets my phone fall over all the time. <laughs> Thanks for this. Okay, so we got some stuff that we're going to be yes. putting we together got some over stuff here, we right? Take part in. Uh, we're going to be doing the earrings. So. Okay, all right. So we got this one and it's already made. This is cute. These like leaf patterns have been really popular and I, I love these. I would wear these for sure. All right, so so once the wood is cut, this is yes. what it looks like. And then what do I do next? I should clean it up, clean the edges off. Where the clean the edges. Register. So this went through the machine to get cut, right? There's yes. a design. Yes. And then, oh, what's this? Is it just like the residue? Residue from yes. like some kind of oil or something? No, that's from the engraving and the cutting of the wood. Does it like kind of like burn it? Because it's, it's, it's like yeah. this black. I'm like just trying to figure out the process. Okay, so we got our wood wiped down. And then what do I do next? Uh, this is the eye hole. This might actually be like a fun project when you get together with the girls. I'm always looking yes. for things to pair with wine. So we're not just drinking wine, <laughs> but we're also like this would be a fun activity after a couple of glasses trying to get this tiny little screw into the top of this earring. Do I screw it all the way down? Oh, yes, mostly, yes. Okay. All Let's right, got that in there. Right. And you put the back piece on. And then we put the back on. Okay. Awesome. And what squeeze. next? Give it a squeeze. Oh, this takes very steady hands. Oh, look. Okay, I think I got it. All right, there you these are. are super cute. <clears throat> Don't they look nice? I love wood as a... Uh, then we have one more for you to do. It's a ornament Oh, for you. my goodness. It's a Desiree ornament. I don't know if you know this, but Christmas is my all-time favorite. I mean, it's not even a holiday. It's really a season for me. It starts, like, immediately after Halloween. So this is great. <laughs> I love this. And those are one of our big sellers also. Are the ornaments really popular? Yes. Yeah, and no, I'm going to have to. You're giving me a lot of gift ideas throughout the year. Like, and it's a nice personal touch to be able to buy something, you know, like this with names and everything. Tell us one more time where people can go, find you, um, give us your phone oh. number and your website. Uh, the name of your business is Blake Engraving. Our website is blakeengraving at vistaprint.com. Our telephone number is 559-554. 0916 and we're always looking for new business. Thank you so much Cleon for joining us today and thank you for my amazing ornament. Thank you for having me. You guys make sure you go to Blake Engraving. They've got some great gifts for mom, dad, everybody in between. Ready to unlock all the available resources to you as a black entrepreneur? Want to connect with one of the largest business organizations in the Central Valley? As a member of the Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce, you get the power of these resources and more. 
Become a member. Visit fnbcc.com slash membership and get started today. Welcome back to FNBCC's Home Shopping Experience. I am here with Nyquan Washington of Quan Rags. How are you? I'm doing good, and what about you? I'm great! I'm so excited that you're here. Uh, I was able to participate in your grand opening recently, and the chamber came out to help you with your ribbon cutting. That was an amazing day. Yeah, it was great. Did you, it, you looked like you were having a lot of fun that day. Yeah, it was surprising. A lot of people came out and supported. That was great. It was really great. You are one of our youngest um, business owners in town, especially with a brick and mortar business. You have a store. Tell me the address. Uh, 2440 North Weber, right off of the freeway across the street from the car wash. Yes, and your store looks amazing. I'm so proud of you Thank and the work that you've done so far. Uh, you know, really inspiring younger people to step up and get it done. You said you started your business with $167, right? $156. $156, even less than I thought. That's, that is amazing. Um, tell me a little bit about how you got started. Uh, I got started with uh, just do-rags. Uh, Barbara was like, I need to do a different different hair, hairstyle. So I was like, okay, you know, do me a hairstyle. And the next thing you know, I went to sleep while he was cutting my hair. And I woke up bald. <laughs> oh, no. And he told me to try to get ways. So, <laughs> so you got into do-rags? Yeah, but in Fresno, at first, there was, like, no designers, no colors, And you're, you seem like a fashionable guy. Yeah, you need so, all the... So I needed every every pair of shoes I had. I needed a matching color. Every designer I wear, I needed a designer do act. So I did a lot of research, went through a lot of vendors, went through a lot of different manufacturers, and I found... You found some great stuff. We got yeah. some amazing stuff here. So, um, you know, we were doing an interview with ABC 30 recently, you and I, and the interviewer was like, I, I had no idea what any of this is for. So just a little bit of background for anybody who's watching who doesn't know. Um, we use do-rags and bonnets and head wraps like this um, for protective styling, to protect our hair, to protect our edges. Black hair is very naturally um, dry. We have to moisturize it a lot. Dry hair. Hair equals breakage, mm -hmm. and so we need this to protect. I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and put this one on now. Yeah. I'll show you guys. This is what I do at night when I'm getting ready to go to bed when I have braids, because these get really heavy. So I just typically kind of wrap it around, doing a little demo. Demos are hard, guys, so please bear with me. <laughs> I usually wrap it around so it's not as heavy. And you gonna help me out? Yeah. <laughs> Pull it in the front. <laughs> Perfect. I like this one because it's got that band that I would probably use it to keep my edges laid down a little bit too. Yeah, you don't have to worry about it falling off your head. Yeah, too. it doesn't come off at all. Like I'm a wild, wild sleeper for yeah. sure. So. You know, if you ever see anybody walking around with this, just know they're just protecting their hair. They're <laughs> they're keeping it safe. It's what also a style too. Yeah, and it's a style. Like I don't think a lot of people know that. I love that you have brought fashion into the functionality of these products. Yeah. So, um, okay, tell me about some of the like styles that you have here. So uh, for the bonnets, I have like velvet bonnets. Velvet bonnets, personally. Uh, they're more comfortable for some girls. I feel like they they're should, softer. They're softer. Mm -hmm. And then the, the designer, uh, as you guys can see, it got some nice band up around it, and it holds better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, this is holding really, really well. And then I also have like the designer do rag. They're really just for style, but they're nice. They have a nice texture to them. Are you gonna try this one on for us? Yeah. Show it. Give us a demo of how you put on a do rag. I've actually. You know, under these braids, I have a short style now, so I've started wearing do-rags do myself. Yeah. Girls wear do-rags too, right? Yeah, a lot. Mm-hmm. I love Tiana Taylor is like, yeah. has really made them yeah, kind of mainstream. Yeah, that's someone probably. I've been trying to get to. Really? Oh, yeah. I love her and Iman. They're like two of my favorites. They're my favorite celebrity couple. All right, so you wrap the tie around. Yeah, I like it. this stitching at the top too. Yeah, some of them, some of the stitching I actually kind of had a tweak with and uh, stitch it up a little bit myself too. Oh, nice. So I just wrap it around once. So you do you leave this out in the back? 
The, uh, what do they call this? Like a tail or a something? tail? Yeah, it just depends how I'm feeling. I know, uh, but most of the time I don't like leaving it around anymore. What do you do? A lot of people pull on it. I tie it up like that. <laughs> people pull on it. Yeah, <laughs> that's funny. I know uh, our producer Vince is from New York. I think there's a thing like people from New York wear different than people other the, places. Uh, the first person to give me my first do rag was from New York, actually. Was it? Yeah, it's yeah. really fashionable there. I think. Uh, Vince, is it tongue out or tongue in? Or <laughs> We're going to have to get producer Vince a, a do-rag and he yeah, can show us so how New Yorkers us. do it. Yep. <laughs> and then I just tie it, wrap it around. Tie it in a knot. Yeah. That's awesome. And this looks really cute with your outfit. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of figured yeah. you were going to make me. You were, yeah. That's why I brought I, this Yeah, you it. were like, just in case she makes me, yeah. he knows me well. This is awesome. So what are these? These are what girls use mostly the, for the edges. Yeah, so uh, for the reason why I brought the hair ties, the hairbands, and the bonnets was because I had other customers that didn't wear do-rags. So for the girls, I brought the bonnets, and I had customers that didn't wear neither. So I brought the hairbands. But a lot of girls asked me uh, they wanted to be able to lay their edges down. So I got this material satin specifically so so that it's so right they can lay it down all the way satin um helps you retain moisture in your yeah. hair right yeah and then also in your bonnet too it also has satin. is lined with satin and so when you're laying on your pillow which is cotton it's not absorbing all yeah. your hair's oils and stuff and then not drying it out for uh black black hair uh they need a lot of satin Mm -hmm. And I don't know if a lot of people know that. Right, yeah. No, you definitely need the satin line lining for to help keep your moisture locked in, protecting our crowns. That's yeah. what we're doing over here. So tell us again, where is your location? Tell us your social media, where people can find you online. Uh, you can find me on all platforms of social media from Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Link, and, uh, Snapchat under Quanrags. And then my website is quanrags.com. You have a big announcement that you're going to share with us today, right? Yeah. Uh, May 1st, I'll be announcing my next store. Oh, my gosh. You're opening a second store. Yeah, for my clothing line. Congratulations. Are you wearing something right now from yeah, your line, right? Yeah, the riches, the out the mud. That is amazing. Onward and upward. We are so excited to see growth. This is exactly what we do here at the Chamber. We engage, educate, and empower business growth. So proud of you, Quan. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for allowing me to be here. Welcome to Collide, an interactive social media debate platform, which allows users to have face-to-face -face video debates in each of the six categories Collide offers. Sports, music, movies, politics, relationships, and current events. Each debate lasts three rounds. Inside of those three rounds, users are given 30 seconds to articulate their opinion. At the completion of the three rounds, each user's followers or any other onlooker will be able to vote on who they believe won the debate. After a 24-hour voting period, the voting polls are closed and the user will receive a win or a loss in said user's profile. Another cool aspect about Collide is you can earn badges in each category. Earn bronze, silver, and gold badges in each category as you are successful at winning debates. These badges will be highlighted in your user profile to show said user strengths. Continue to win debates and you can be at the top of the top 100 leaderboard in any of the six categories. Collide will also be used to enhance communication and critical thinking in academia. Collide has the opportunity to become a game changer in the higher education space. Collide can help facilitate open, respectful, and civil discourse that can help students become the educated and enlightened citizens we need them to be. Orlando Leon, Chief Information Officer, California State University, Fresno. Welcome to Collide, where opinions meet. 
We are back with Kina McFadden, Miss I Connect Dot. Oh, Welcome, well. Kina. <laughs> Thank you, Des. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited to have you here. We could literally be here to talk to Kina about a million different things because she's got her hand in everything. Uh, but today we're here to talk about the Collide for Parkinson's golf tournament that is coming up on April 17th. We actually went out to the golf course, yes. right? And, and tried our hand at putting because, yeah. Actually, just... Can you roll the footage? Roll the clip, please. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, beautiful mimosa. Cheers. I'm Dragonfly Golf Club. Thank you for joining me this oh, morning. Thank you for having me. So we are here to practice our golf, golf skills because you are hosting a benefit, right? Yes, a fundraiser for Parkinson's golf tournament. It's our very first annual golf tournament right here in this beautiful course. I know everybody's excited. We are both black and vaccinated. Whoa, whoa black and vaccinated. And <laughs> I know people are excited <laughs> to get back outside again. And yes. so I think a golf tournament supporting uh, a wonderful cause is a great way to get started this spring. Absolutely. So Absolutely. we don't know how to play golf. No. <laughs> <laughs> only one problem. <laughs> it's only one single problem. It's a good problem to have because right. we have 120 one golfers it's that true. know how to golf. There we go. And, we and have, today we're here to yes. learn a little bit. We're going to practice, I think, our putting. Yes. And I was going to say we have a little bit of time to practice. So. Yes. Woohoo. Yes. I'm excited. You look really cute, by the way. Well, you know, I don't. I think I'm looking at myself with a different <laughs> color shirt. You look fabulous. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And, All yeah. right. Let's let's get some <laughs> golf going. Yes. <laughs> let's go. <golf. laughs> okay. Is this how I stand? No, not sure. Tell me how to stand. I don't want to look stupid. Okay. Can I have to follow that? Yeah, come on. No. Come on. Okay, you got this. I'm too busy to <laughs> The A1 effort is what it was. An A1 effort. Okay, high five. So, me like I, I think it's in the knee bend. I think it's, it's got to be in the, you know, the tooch and pooch. <laughs> All right, you got this. Through the middle. Through the middle. Through the middle. <laughs> she hit the other side. How you hit the other side? Hit the hey, I'm getting them warmed up. She hit both sides. Hey. <laughs> Listen, hey, hey, yeah. listen. Okay. She's coming for you. I'm coming right for you. Dragonfly Golf Club. We are going in the middle. <laughs> we are in. Let's do it. I'm hitting these balls. Do it. <laughs> a break, good time. Let's come, come on. on. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> All right. Kina, thank you so much for joining me out here today to practice my golf skills before the tournament on the 17th. Yes. That's going to be a blast. So you said you've already got 121 tickets sold. How many do we have left? 121 golfers are committed and paid for. So a full golf tournament is 144 players. Wow. And we're so there's excited. there's only a handful of tickets left. That's right. April 17th is our golf tournament, Collide for Parkinson's, right here at the beautiful uh, Dragonfly Golf, golf Club. Club. And I want to thank um, Fresno Metro Black. Black Chamber of Commerce and thank you and the crew for coming out and helping helping practice hit some balls. Yeah. <laughs> you guys make sure to come out for Collide for Parkinson's golf tournament. Uh, it's supporting a great cause um, and some great local businesses are involved and, yes. and just an opportunity to get out of the house. Team That's Black right. and Vaccinated. Whoop, whoop. We came and we conquered the <laughs> golf course. That's right. You guys We're have out. a good day. Bye. See you April 17th. <laughs> Oh it was the dad's wiggle for me. <laughs> you already knew I was going to oh mention it. Oh my gosh. You know what, y'all? 
all, don't, I don't know who lets me be on camera. Let's, I really don't. Right. Okay, but <laughs> let's, all right. So tell me uh, about the Collide for Parkinson's so much fun. Uh, event that's coming up, this golf tournament. Yes. It's, uh, it's benefiting Parkinson's disease. Yes, it is. Um, and also, Collide is what? Well, Collide is a new app that's getting ready to be featured at Fresno State, and it's created by an amazing uh, Fresno State athlete, uh, alumni, Vince Mays, yeah. created this cool app called Collide for students to engage. It's a college community app. And Fresno State has adopted it uh, to beta test it. And so we're definitely getting ready to showcase that amazing app for the students to stay in school, you know, and to continue to further their education. That is just huge. Yes. I actually was at Fresno State with Vince. Is that right? I think it's amazing that he's <laughs> developed this app and now Fresno State is picking it up. Like, those are the types of valley moves I love to That's see. That's right. He came back to the valley. He's giving back to the valley. He's from the valley. And so, and you know, and we're getting ready to have this golf tournament uh, collide for Parkinson's at Dragonfly Golf Club in the valley. You know. So something exciting happened since we shot that at the golf course. <laughs> you are now actually sold out of tickets, right? Yes. What a great, great uh, right. problem to have. It's a great problem to, to have, have, especially during the pandemic and. A lot of people are, you know, skeptical about going out. We have 144 paid golfers, so we have a full golf tournament for 18 That's holes. That's amazing. Collide for Parkinson's golf tournament is going to be already. It's, it's going to be a really success, good day. But it's going to be so much fun, as you can already see, with Des and I having fun on the oh, green. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be an amazing day. a blast. I'm actually <laughs> going to be out there doing yes. terribly for, any, <laughs> for anybody who wants to come and see. So yes. we're no longer looking for participants, but we are still looking for some sponsors, right? Yes, absolutely. Sponsors, donations, and silent auction items are very important because our give back is to the Parkinson's um, disease awareness and uh, what Vince Mays did was he partnered with a gentleman named John who has Exercise for Life Foundation oh, wow. and he actually works with Parkinson clients um, that have the disease and he has strengthened them through his program Exercise for Life so oh, with wow. Collide Exercise for Life they um, they called me and it was an honor to be a part of it and so now Collide for Parkinson's d um, disease uh, golf tournament is powered by iConnect. So I'm super excited that yeah. we're all connected. And uh, a lot of people that were on your show uh, today yeah, uh, actually some of the sponsors for the event, right? The event. So I'm super excited. I'm going to be that. wearing my solar hat out there, and she's donated <laughs> some for for prizes as well, right? Yes, Cool Breeze Solar Hat has uh, donated a couple hats for our silent auction item, and yep, they'll and, be out there. And Cleon from B Blake Engraving mentioned to me earlier that he's going to be doing yes. some engraving for you guys as well. That he he's engraving is. tees. Yes, and, and a couple of like surprise gifts for maybe some winners. We don't. No, but nice. yeah, we're using Blake's as well and Gravery. I love um, to see that that black business synergy. Yes. All of our members networking <laughs> and working together toward yeah. a common goal, especially for a good cause like Parkinson's. So tell me a little bit. I mean, for those of the those people out there who might not know I Connect Dots, which very few, <laughs> but but for anybody in the community that doesn't know who you are and what you do, I mean, obviously you're helping promote this event. But tell me just a little bit about I Connect Dots and how you work work in the community. Well, absolutely. Born and raised right in Fresno, uh, West Fresno area. Went. Um, you know, went to school in almost every elementary and junior high that was over there and uh, high school and just I was able to connect with the community and with my neighborhood and with the city in general. And, um, you know, it was a God given name. I connect dots. It stands for itself. Um, you know, I can see a lot better with EYE versus the singular I. Mm -hmm. And um, and it was a vision. And so with me being able to connect people to people, and businesses to business, it just came natural that uh, I have a passion to just connect people to people and, 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 and I thrive on businesses, you know, building off of other businesses. And then especially if we, we all uh, look alike, that's even better because we're recycling the black dollar and I love the fact that we are black and vaccinated. Absolutely. Ah, oh my God, we, we said that like 10 <laughs> times. We're so excited about yes, it. Yes, so I, I connect dots and um, I usually do a, a personal field because it is personal 
personal to me um, because it's important to be connected. Absolutely. Can't do anything alone, and that's why I appreciate this collaborative with the Fresno Black Chamber of Commerce. I love being a member, and I love seeing not only members, you know, collectively, but friends and family, and how we're all working together for common goal to yes. create awareness for products and services. So that's what Collide I connect. for Parkinson's that's golf tournament. It's coming up on April about. 17th. If there are any other business owners out there that would like to donate sponsored prizes yes. or would yes. like to donate any money, this is going towards a great cause and some great organizations supporting homegrown Fresno business. Kina, thank you yes. so much for oh, being here with us thank today. Thank you. Thank you for having me. And thanks again. I'm sure for we'll see you again soon for some, on another the fun event. Oh, on the and green. We'll see you on yep. the green on the 17th. April 17th, Dragonfly Golf Club. We are going to be there, collide for Parkinson's, uh, powered by iConnect Dots, and we're excited already to have a yes. full tournament. Thanks for having us. Thank you for coming. Yes. Awesome. Give me a hug. I love you. Me too. Thank you so much for tuning in today to our second episode of the Fresno Metro Black Chamber of Commerce's Home Shopping Experience. I want to thank all of our guests today, Blake Engraving, Cool Breeze Solar Hats, Tower Blends, Quan Rags, and Kina from iConnect Dots. We are so excited for our next episode. If you are interested in participating in the show, please go to our website, fmbcc.com slash HSE. There's a form there to get signed up for the show and also become a member. This is one of our many membership perks here at the chamber. And so we would be so excited to work with you. Everybody enjoy the rest of your Saturday.